Early extubation after cardiac surgery is beneficial. However, it is unclear whether operating room extubation is superior to extubation within six hours after leaving the operating room, which we will refer to as fast-track extubation. From the Society of Thoracic Surgeons Adult Cardiac Surgery Database, this study identified adult patients who underwent non-emergent cardiac surgery between July 2017 and December 2022 to compare outcomes of operating room extubation and fast-track extubation. The surgical procedures included isolated cabbage, isolated aortic valve replacement, isolated mitral valve replacement or repair, and combinations of cabbage and valve surgeries. The final sample was divided into two study groups, an operating room extubation group of 36,298 patients from 296 centers, and a fast-track extubation group of 632,801 patients from 1,066 hospitals. Of note, patients from centers with fewer than 10 operating room or fast-track extubations were excluded from those respective groups, as were patients who died intraoperatively. The outcomes measured included postoperative mortality within 30 days or during the index hospitalization, major operative morbidity or mortality, length of stay, reintubation, reoperation for bleeding, and various other morbidities. The results showed that operating room extubation patients had lower unadjusted rates of the examined endpoints. After adjustment, operating room extubation was protective for postoperative mortality, composite operative morbidity and mortality, reintubation or reoperation for bleeding, and prolonged length of stay greater than 14 days. In contrast, fast track extubation slightly but significantly increased the risk for the four endpoints. The results from all procedures aggregated were quite consistent with the stratified procedure-specific results. In summary, operating room extubation is safe and effective and may be associated with superior outcomes in selected patients undergoing cardiac surgery.